Cisco Firepower and HashiCorp's Terraform series, Infrastructure as Code. We'll be focusing on day zero and day one deployments. In this first video, we're gonna create a user account that's going to allow us access to Firepower through a programmatic means. So let's go ahead and make sure that we are enabled for API access. So we'll go into configurations, we'll go to rest API preferences, and we'll make sure that we're enabled. Once that's done, let's go ahead and create the user. Again, this is a very simple video, um, but I want to walk through the steps with everyone from start to finish. So let's go ahead and create that user, give it a name. And let's go ahead here and I'll show you a configuration that we're going to get very familiar with. Go ahead and use that name. And this could be whatever you want. This happens to be the name I chose. Go ahead and put in a password. Go ahead and write that down if you want. It's an internal segmented uh, lab and it's temporary. Go ahead and paste that in. We'll give it administrative access and we'll go ahead and save this out. Now, in my case, this is a lab environment and I'm gonna use Terraform to tear up and tear down um, configurations within Firepower. We'll continue to build upon that during this series, so it should get exciting. Ooh. 